If you did not know, the company Follicom is doing groundbreaking work in the hair loss industry at the moment. They have a completely new product in the pipeline where the studies and before and after is definitely demanding attention. This is something that you definitely don't want to miss out on. Some time ago, Follicum released a study on their product FOL005 and the study actually showed promising results in a lot of patients. Unfortunately, there's been a lot of stuff going on at Follicum. They changed the management, they changed the headquarters and they just changed the overall structure of the company, putting their work on a somewhat standby at the moment. But it seems like there's now hope ahead of the company. Currently, the new management is trying to raise around $15 million to fund their new investigation on FOL005. And man, do I hope that they'll get the funding in their FDA phase two trial. And yes, you heard me, it's already at phase two. FOL proved to be able to increase the average hair count on the scalp after only 12 weeks by an amazing 12 hairs per square centimeter. And even some of their participants gained up to 23 new hairs per square centimeter. And only from 12 weeks on this stuff. Just take a look at these pictures. If you have good eyes, unlike me who need glasses to spot the difference, you can definitely see the difference in 12 weeks in the area that I have pointed out for you. This is really impressive. And I don't know about you, but the average scalp is around 500 square centimeters. And let's just say it would give, let's say 10 hairs per square centimeter to make the math easy. That is around 5,000 new hairs on your scalp. Even some of the best hair transplants can't even go that high. So we are looking at the equivalent of a hair transplant in only 12 weeks. I don't know about you, but I would definitely like that treatment to get ready soon. So what is special about FOL005? Well, one potentially advantageous fact of FOL005, according to Follicum, is its mechanism of action. FOL binds to the neuropillin 1 receptor, or NRP1, and producing a stimulating or agonistic effect. This kind of lands outside the more typical attempts to manipulate hair growth involving the androgen pathway which can lead to sexual side effects. And we definitely all know the horror stories from the unlucky patients of stuff like finasteride and so on. So a treatment with potentially no sexual side effects would be much welcome in my book. Follicum's website has a page dedicated to explaining its research in further detail for those interested. And of course, as usual, I put a link in the description for their website. All in all, FOL looks really promising. And according to the latest news from Follicum, it apparently shows that FOL is specifically very potent in men with severe hair loss, showing the biggest results in men with less than 255 hairs per square centimeter. Once again, showing that if you are severely balding, it does not mean that all hope is lost. On the contrary, some medications might actually work even better for those of you who struggle the most. But FOL 005 is not ready yet to go on the shelves. So if you are dealing with hair loss at the moment and don't have a plan for this, I can definitely recommend to go and watch this video about RU58841 or this video about finasteride. Both are solutions that work for hair loss in men and they are available to use while we wait for the next big breakthrough in hair loss treatments.